What an eventful night for the Rockets as they took on Arkansas State in the 2015 Go Daddy Bowl. The Rockets had been in Mobile, Alabama since December 31st and the big day had finally arrived and so did the UT students and fans. The Red Wolves took ball possession first and on the first play of the game, Trayvon Hester caused a fumble recovered in the end zone for a touchdown by Trent Voss. The Rockets taking the lead early on, gaining a lot of momentum on the first play of the game. On the next possession, Toledo had a 12-play drive that ended with a four-yard touchdown from Kareem Hunt, the Rockets leading 14-7 over Arkansas State. With about two minutes and 40 seconds left in the first quarter, Hunt speeds past the Red Wolves defense for a 44-yard touchdown to score 21-7 Toledo. Midway through the second quarter, on an eight-play drive, the Rockets drove down the field and Logan Woodside hands the ball off to Kareem Hunt. And again, he rushes for a 29-yard touchdown this time for the Rockets. They're now up 28-17. to Now Arkansas State with possession. The quarterback is sacked by Jordan Martin and caused a fumble recovered by defensive end Allen Covington. And he runs 67 yards for a Rocket touchdown going into halftime. Toledo led 35-17 to over Arkansas State. On Toledo's second drive out of halftime, Kareem Hunt scored a six-yard touchdown, so the score was 42-17, to Toledo up going into the next drive. In the fourth quarter, Toledo's first drive, 11 plays, ended with a one-yard touchdown from Kareem Hunt. On Toledo's next drive, Damian Jones more in for Kareem Hunt. He helps lead the Rockets down the field and then rushes to the sideline as he stretches for a 10-yard touchdown, putting Toledo up 56-38 over the Red Wolves. Just over two minutes left in the game on Toledo's last drive, Damian Jones more breaks away for a 29-yard touchdown. For the final touchdown of the game, the Rockets are victorious in the 2015 Go Daddy Bowl over Arkansas State. The final score of the game, 63-44. to I couldn't think of a greater way for our program to, to finish off its season, and I couldn't be, think of a greater tribute for our 17 seniors to leave with the great win that we got here today. And, and I, the last but not least, let me, let me say this about the Go Daddy Bowl. Uh, one of the greatest experiences that I've had, um, our kids have had an unbelievable time, the city of Mobile, uh, all the unbelievable volunteerism that has been tremendous to us. This has been a, quite a ride, and so we're, we're extremely grateful. And with that. Well, I mean, you got to give credit to the defensive line and the guys who are attacking the ball. You know, Hess got in there, made a great play, stripping it, and Boggs seemed like it was bouncing around forever. And I just happened to be there to fall on it, and it's just great to get a play like that to start off the game just in the moment. I look at every game and try and go big, but the offense line, they come on to play and make those holes, and I just you know, try and find them every time. They meant so much to me. Like honestly, those guys, they carried me, and you know, I've been with them since my freshman year, and we got a great connection. And it, it sucks to see those guys leave, but I'm just happy that they left with a win. So. Yeah.